McNair Elementary. He entered that property coming in, we suspect, behind someone. He was armed with an AK-47 and a number of other weapons. When we received a call and we engaged, he started to fire from inside of the school at our officers. Uh, what we know right away is that he had one or two of the staff members inside the main office. Uh, he was holding them captive. Uh, units continued to respond. He would continue to fire upon officers. Officers were able to return fire when they saw him in uh, 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 alone by himself. Subsequent to all that, no one was injured. He uh, surrendered to uh, police authorities here in DeKalb. And uh, <clears throat> at that point, he was taken into custody where he's, where he's now uh, with our investigators. It's an ongoing investigation. Uh, once we had him in custody, at that point, we had to secure the entire school which meant that we sent our SWAT teams in and they cleared each classroom until the school was cleared. Uh, upon further investigation, what we learned that the vehicle that he came in was parked in front of the vehicles and when our canine dogs hit on the vehicle, uh, we suspect it may have been some type of explosives inside of the vehicle. We could, at that, that time, we had to move the kids from the rear of the school and find an escape route, which we had to cut a hole in a fence take the kids through the back of a house, down a small